What's going on guys? Sophisticated here bringing another Fizz gameplay video. Today we're in the mid lane. We're up against another Yoni actually. So pretty popular champ. Looks like my team's looking for a little invade. So we started the recording a little early here. Not sure what Rek'Sai's doing. He's kind of behind the times here. Oh, here we go. Now nah, he's going to use his E. All right, we got some XP though. Actually, I think we just keep going. I think we keep going maybe, right? Potentially. They don't have any wards here. Do a little cheeky cut them off here, maybe. Oh, dude. Disgusting poke by them. I think we just bail at this point. All right, yeah. So we are coming off the back of a Lissandre loss. We just played against a Lissandre. Uh, unfortunately, the recording, like, my mic was muted the whole time. So I did not even get that footage. But we're sitting at 26 LP, or 28, rather. We're at 54 that game. We lost 26. Somehow, it's kind of crazy. We're on a six game win streak and we're only getting like 23 lp a win and then i lose after a six game win streak and lost 26 lp so feels bad man um i really don't want to come to this because i'm gonna miss some of the first three minions i think we just have to give that i think he just has to give yeah don't die there i'm gonna walk away from that guy not gonna give him a chance to hit me Maybe uh, Rek'Sai will just look for his re his blue buff. I want to hit this minion. Because I can probably... Oh, damn. Just kidding. I was thinking maybe I would be have enough uh, damage to auto that other one. So he is level 2. Be able to do a little bit... Oh, wow. I, that was weird. The tower like targeted him and then stopped hitting him. I don't think we get this one. Be able to look for a little poke onto him here. I'm not sure how he's hitting us this often and not taking tower shots. Rek'Sai might be able to look for a gank onto him. I don't know, though. So farming just as decent as him. He doesn't have... I think we go for this guy here. I think we go for him here. He's going to cue me for sure. Just going to cue him. I'm saving my cue for when he comes back. He's going to have to come back. That's tragic. I'll flash for him. I think it's absolutely worth it. Because if he gets away there, it's really bad. Nice. Our bot lane's getting kills. And I can make him potentially miss this whole wave as well. Because this wave is so big. That his minions should kill all of these. He's got to bail. I can't help him. He's got to just give that blue buff. Because I need to get a reset in. Oh, I leveled my W. That's really, really bad. Um, The wave is going to be quite awful, but the way this guy's playing, he's probably just going to push us in. I just have to get a reset in there. There's no way I stay. Um, I think we grab the Corrupting Pot here just for the extra sustain. We might be able to kill this guy again if he stays pushing like that. I don't want to use my E, though, because it's like a, what, 13, 14 second cooldown early. I think he needs to wait. No, 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 right here, right here. I think we go for this for sure. He should probably, like, look to engage here at this point. I want to try and bait this. Oh, this dude's so dead. He has no flash. He's absolutely dead. There's no way this guy survives this. I want let to get the kill. Nice. I want to get the kill myself for Dark Seal stacks. Yeah, this Yoni is playing a little too aggressive. Super, super good for us, though. We'll take it. I'm coming here. We need uh, Trundle to come help. I want to look for him. Uh, he's going to get away. That's fine. Actually, is he going to... That's fine. He gets away. Well, we didn't miss too much for that. And if we... We potentially could have got a, another kill. So, it's absolutely worth it. And I like how that... I like that mechanic that he can just bounce over like that and auto ward down. I think we need to be contesting this. We're so far ahead right now. I can kind of just slow push this wave. I want to look for a little trade song to him here. 
I have a big wave, so this guy can't really trade that well into us right now. I might look for a cheeky, super cheeky little bot roam here. Looks like my team is going to kill them anyways, though. But that's good. I'm close to level 6. I'm not sure who will get it first, me or him. It's a good trade by him. Um, he's... If he gets level 6 first, he can kill us. If we get level 6, we can kill him. I want to hold this wave right here, though. Because if he's resetting, I can make him miss some farm. And if he doesn't reset, we're almost level 6, right? We can look for a kill onto him. We'll get it off of this uh, cannon minion here. Oh, I didn't reset my W. Pretty tragic. If this guy stays, we can definitely look for a kill here. This is ult. That's fine. We'll go ult for ult there. Kind of sucks that they killed our bot lane because they could potentially do a drag now. Yeah, this guy should be dead. If we get a knock up onto him. We just don't want to get knocked up ourselves. I don't want to go for him. I'll die. I'm actually kind of low here. So I'm just going to bail here. Let me get a reset in. Tristano will go down there. And unfortunately, the Graves is going to have two kills. But gets kills for it. I don't think we go for that, bro. I have to reset. I had so much gold on me. Hopefully, he doesn't die to the Yoni there. All right. Did get a shutdown onto our Tristana, but she's 4-1. She should come back super spiked up. And I am ridiculously strong. I don't think we give this to them. We are way stronger. Nice. I'm going to catch this whole wave here, too. I think we do this. Hopefully, Rek'Sai doesn't... He's wanting to prioritize the Herald. But I think the Drakes are way more important. Drakes, you have, like, late-game insurance with those. Like, Herald is just temporary leads. Although, I might be able to look for their bot lane. Oh, here we go. I need my team to come. Oh, I messed this up so bad. Ah, uh, we don't have Chris. They get a free Drake now, and they'll probably get some kills, too, off of it. I got to flash this and not get knocked up. Man, if <laughs> I hate junglers who just kind of mess around. Like, we should have absolutely been going for that dragon. There's no reason with having a 4-0 bot lane, a 2-0 mid, that we give that right there. <sighs> that, that gets under my skin so much. There's no way that Graves should be able to get that dragon there. Because I don't think Rick Harold is worth that at all. Like, it's not worth what we just lost. Not even a little. The Hextech Dragon is, like, one of the best dragons, too. You get free attack speed and ability haste. It's like a cracked dragon. Really sucks. Maybe... Yeah, just a really unfortunate time. This guy's got a lot of uh, XP over me now, too, because I went in Rome to do that to help try and take that Drake. With my ult, I might be able to kill him. Really, really unlucky. This Graves is actually pretty freaking strong now at this point. The only bad thing is this guy's got his ult, too, for sure. He's going to have to ult away. Yeah, there it is. We don't kill. Well, maybe Rek'Sai kills? Nice. There we go. I think he needs to use this Herald. Use the Herald on this. Let's take, let's take advantage of that. Of losing the dragon. I think our top lane might go down there. Nice. He's giving me those plates, too. Super good. Top lane does go down. Hopefully not. Doesn't. Oh, man. This could be bad for me. Hopefully he doesn't give too many kills over to Tom Kench. Because Tom Kench, we can 
Comes like a raid boss, man. I want to look for one more wave here. I want to grab this wave. Oh, I might die here. I might die here. I do. God damn it. I'm so greedy, man. That is so bad for me. If I just did not die there, I just didn't want to give this whole wave. I gave him a nice shutdown, and he gets free time in the lane as well. He's going to be here if our bot lane roams, maybe. They can look to do something. That was really bad by me, though. I was doing super good all up until that point. I should have just used, kept my E and just queued through him to get to the wave instead of using my E. It's all good. This Graves is putting in a lot of work, unfortunately. Can we look for a dive bot? I don't know. Are they low at all? No fear. With Rek'Sai back, and I don't really want to look for a dive, I'll just catch the wave here mid. Man, that was a really bad death by me. Kind of gave Yoni a way back into the game. I don't know if I even want to look top. This guy's um, almost impossible to kill. I think the better play is just go looking bot, but... Seraphine Zareth have me a little sketched out because they have so much CC. I do want to look for the dive, though. With Rek'Sai. I need them to shove this wave. Especially if they have a ward right here. They have vision. Should be able to kill one of them here. Nice. Might even be able to kill two here. Yeah, we should get two here. Nice. That's super good. Tom Kinch is on a killing spree, though. Or no, Graves is. It's really bad. Our bot lane is going to be really strong. Their top and jungle are going to be very strong. So, we both have ways to win the game here. guy did get some plates there and a good amount of farm but i'm gonna say worth i just do not like the fact that this tom kench is getting as strong as he is that was a bad e by me i might be dead here the graves is gonna ult me damn it dude this graves is just everywhere man he flash rexai should be able to kill him here because he probably doesn't have ult up rexai does have ult Nice. Good play. Good play. Damn, if it wasn't for that, Graves. We need to be getting this. We have to contest these Drakes. We cannot allow them to get stack up Drakes. We don't want to get too far in a hole where, like, they only need one dragon to get soul, right? Graves is still down for one second, too, so... Plus, we might be able to look for some kills here. If the enemy team gets too crazy. This guy. Now, I just got to wait to see where he's posturing to. We definitely fight this. We fight this for sure. For a fish onto him. We could start this fight. So good. I think we go for this. We go for this guy. He's the stronger. We kill him. That's huge. I don't think we go for her, though. All right, that's pretty massive right there for us. Double kill and the Drake. Although this Yoni has a habit of killing me on my way back to the tower, so I got to watch out for this guy. All right, my bot lane's doing really well. I'm doing pretty well. My jungle's doing well also. Right, I just got to give this guy a little bit of respect. He is decently strong. So let's not give this guy any free kills. I think we can actually reset here. Grab uh, Seekers. Hopefully this guy just... Yeah, he's dead again. I don't think he understands. Like, I don't think he wins fights against the Tom Kench. That Tom is just going to be so insanely strong. Trundle just needs to run and not fight that guy. And this guy's about to get my fucking tower. Damn, bro. It's the Yoni treatment. If I had Ignite, I'd go for this guy. 
These guys gotta be careful. I think he got all five plates too there, the Yoni did. If I had Ignite, I'd absolutely go for this guy. Dude, look at that damage just from a couple abilities. What is this? He didn't hit anything on me and half helps me like that. Isn't that crazy? That is just absolutely insane. Misses all, misses multiple cues. I gotta throw that just to zone. That was absolutely insane by that champ. Literally missed everything on me. Hit me with like maybe a couple autos. Wild, bro. Oh, she's going for it. What is this? Chill. She's going ham. Kinda like it. Okay. All right, well, apparently she's that guy, pal. I'm gonna come down here and catch waves. That's so crazy, man. Uh, two, two and five Yoni with all he has is boots and a static ship. And he hit me with like literally two autos, misses all, misses Q2, and just almost kills me from full health. Hopefully this Graves doesn't get a kill there. He probably will though. This Trundle is uh, not really respecting anyone. We are soaking up some good farm here, though. Good XP. I'm hoping Yoni goes mid to try and help his team. No, there he is. I actually can't even stay here. Yoni is such a brain-dead champ, man. You literally just auto-attack and Q the wave and people. You just get everything you need. All right, we'll back. Do that. I don't think we need to... I don't think we can really buy anything, so we'll just go ahead and say, hold on to that 400. We have alt and ignite up, so we might be able to go for a kill onto him if he stays. I don't see him staying, though. We did get the second herald. This jungler is so good, man. This guy, this Rek'Sai is really good. Right, there's Yoni. I'm just going to back away from him. I'm not giving him a chance to... Get that extra bonus damage onto me. Nice. Our, our Tristana is going insane. She's doing like, crazy work. All right, we'll just soak up some farm here. Match the Yoni. We're only down by about 20 farm. I kind of want to group up around my team at this point, though. It looks like they might be making a push for the mid lane tower. Nah, I don't think we go for that. I think we just siege mid. Siege mid here and stick around with the team. Play for this Drake. I think the, the Drake is the play here, boys. I think we go for this. I want to see what they do here. We don't have Rek'Sai, so it is a little sketchy just sitting here in this bush. Because they have good AoE damage, too. With the Seraphine. We do have Trundle TP, so... If Trundle needs a TP, he can. I think we just come to this. Hopefully our ADC comes, because she's... Oh, wow, they went three top. All right, this drag should be completely free for us then. I'm not even going to... I don't think I need to... Yeah, I don't think I need to go there. They got Tristana, and she's 10 kills. So she's going to have more damage than me anyways. He wants that blue buff. I think we can take it. We have a lot of pressure right now. All right, we're just sitting here soaking up waves. This is going really good. It's exactly what we want. Come grab this blue buff. Just kind of hang around my team right now. Um, it, They're wanting to make a play mid. I'm just going to try and do whatever I can. Damn, we both got killed there. Both of our teammates, the Yoni, went in. Rek'Sai kind of left us hanging there. He went to take the Gromp instead of making the play with the team. But to be honest, I think Tristana and Nami both went a little too ham. So that's... It's really our only first mistake, but giving Yoni a big shutdown, Yoni and uh, Graves, a big shutdown like that is going to be pretty bad for us. 
Trundle will die there as well for sure. He might be able to lead him on a wild goose chase at least. I may be able to come behind this. I don't have ult though. That's the only scary thing here. I don't know how tanky she is either. Ooh, brother. I got her flash. Might be able to... I might be dead myself. I am going to die here, potentially. All right. I got the kill on her, which is really good, but I almost died there, so that would not have been worth it. And it looks like Rek'Sai did die. So we're kind of getting sloppy here in the back half of the game. Hopefully Yoni isn't fast enough to catch me here. All right. Got the Zanyas. That's a huge spike for us. Uh, we're probably going to give this tower down here bot lane. Unless Trundle has TP, he does not. I think we go for this. I think we go for this with Trundle. Potentially. With Yoni being bot lane with no TP, I think we could have done that. I think we give Yoni whatever. Even if we have to give a tier 2. If we end up getting Baron off of it, it's super worth. The only thing is if Grave steals it, we're kind of screwed. Oh, we definitely can test this. I got both of them here. This is huge. Where did that guy go? I'm going for the... Ooh, I'm going to zone you this. I'm kind of getting toasted by this Tom Kench. All right, now it's a free Baron. Oh, we lost Rek'Sai. It'd be very sketchy to try and take this. Actually, we need... This guy's taking our fucking base. Uh, that's brutal, man. If Re we didn't lose Rek'Sai, we could have got a lot. We're actually going to come out pretty negative of this here. This guy's going to for sure get our tower here. He's going to try and kill him here. He did get our tower. I think we go for it now, yeah. We need Trundle to come up here. I think we all just rush this down right now. We need everyone. I need to grab this blue buff. We need Rek'Sai. I'm just gonna pop all my pots, try to stay as healthy as possible. I'm gonna look to zone these guys. If I can keep the uh, Zareth away from doing much. Please do not get us all killed here. All right, we got the Baron. I think we just survived here at this point. I don't even think it's worth for me to fight them. We just got to survive. Ah, uh, Tristana died. I'm not sure how that happened. Someone's got to collect this way. Why would you even try to take your take camps there, dude? Oh my goodness, brothers. We're losing so much off of this. Yeah, and then he dies there too. What is this, dude? My team is really trolling this up, man. Rexai started this game so incredibly good. This Tom Kinch. What is this, dude? Why are you building the Hydra? Oh, we're getting kind of griefed here by our teammates here. We have a full damage trundle when we have so many chances to deal an immense amount of damage. I'm going to buy the Soul Stealer. We're going to lose. Yeah, we lose Drake off of that. That sucks so much, man. Especially when we have Baron and like we have strong, like as strong of a mid and bot lane as we do. This ugh, sucks so much, man. This Tom Kinch is just going to take the game over. If we can maybe burst him down, it would be good, but the hit the... Okay, I was going to say his team is going to be coming. Oh, where's my... Oh, my God. My E didn't go off. I don't even know which way to go here. I got to slow, so maybe we can do something here. Did our Trist Ana die? Where is our Trist? She's up here, bro. We lose the whole game off of that, I think. She's going to... Yeah, she just has to survive, get out of there. I don't know how we lost that fight. We took out Tom Kinch immediately. And Tristana had to have been pretty healthy, so that's really weird. 
This build right here by this guy going full damage. He doesn't have any tanky stats. And she dies there too. Jesus Christ, man. We have a 13 kill ADC and she's getting killed by the two and six Seraphine. Wild. I think we sell this at this point. Um, grab a fiendish. They won't catch me. Man, super grief, man. Super grief. Just a lot of very small mistakes. What are you doing, Trundle? It's obvious that I'm running down here, dude. This is a very, very close game. Anyone can win right now. Their bot lane, this Seraphine has 10 stacks on a Dark Seal. So that's pretty bad for us. And we didn't get anything out of that Baron that we spent so many resources for. This Tom Kench is almost impossible to kill too. What is this, man? They're just bullying our team here at this point. They're gonna die. Dude, this freaking Tom Kinch. No, come here, boys. Why is our bot lane not looking to make plays here? What is this game right now, bro? Like, actually, what is this game? We're gonna lose our bot lane. What is my team doing? What is this game? Oh my god, dude. We're gonna lose our inhib because these two are just running around, not rotating for the team. This is mad. This is madness. I don't think I can kill this guy either. Look for a flash fish onto him. He just gets the end hip here for free. Yeah, so fucking troll, man. So troll, man. We got we got a single tower. We didn't even get an end hip that we just traded for that. Madness, man. Absolute madness. Our Nami and our Tristana like crazy that they just allowed that to happen. Absolutely insane. We got nothing either. It all starts with this trundle too, man. This guy just fighting the Tom Kench on repeat. This is uh, what you call the reverse snowball. And this guy, Jesus, man. We got trundle just splitting top lane. Our jungler trying to 1v9. Yoni is actually extremely spiked up at this point. And they have this super minion wave crash in here, so we can't even really do too much. I just have to try and push it as much as possible. This chick is actually very strong. I don't think I can do anything to her. I'm going to sit right here, though, just in case if she does keep pushing. We have a Drake in 50. Our team definitely don't fight that. I push up that wave super hard. I think we just peel back to this. I don't think so. I think that taking the inhib is the play. I'm super strong. Tristana's ridiculously strong. I don't know why we're opting to go for the tower that has an inhib on it, but whatever. Yeah, I'm not sure what's going on here with my team. They're all pressuring down on that super minion way for some reason. Really, really weird. We're not going to get anything off of Yoni being dead. Our bot lane's going to die there. More than likely. Yeah. It sucks. It's so tragic, man. And we're not even going to get the, the mountain drag either. The enemy team can just contest it. We just bail there. I really want to sneak this inhib, but... If I do and we don't get it, it gives him Baron. So it's pretty sketchy. I think they're going for Baron. I'm just gonna see if they have any vision here. Oh, 
Oh, this guy's not even paying attention here. I might have just won the game here. Let's go, boys. I may have just won the game for my team. They're winning. They're, this is a 2v5 right now, or 2v whatever. I literally just killed their jungler and their support, or ADC technically. I'm just going to let my team do whatever they're going to do there. Just proxy this wave. Should be a free Baron. This guy shouldn't be able to give, kill me. I'll just double E, Q out. All right, I'm causing a lot of havoc there. That's huge. Got Baron, got the Drake. Killed two people. It's absolutely massive. I'm going to sell that at this point. I need them to not take this farm. Because I, I want to get my death cap. Bro, back off, please. This guy doesn't get it, man. Does not get it. This trundle needs to tank up. We need some form of like tankiness. I really want to farm out my death cap. I also kind of need to be with my team. I'm not sure what we're doing. None of our my teammates are doing anything with this Baron. I need 300 more gold. Bro, can we do something? My team's going to die there probably. We got Trundle just chilling here. Not really paying attention. All right, cool. They killed. They get a pick. Even if they lose the fight, that should be decent for us. Trundle's still just pushing. I just insta-killed this guy. Hit him with my fish. Yeah, he's dead here. I'm coming for you, brother. There we go. Massive pressure here created. Yeah, this is game, boys. We freaking hard carried this one. That last fight where we killed the Seraphim and the Graves, that was a massive play by us. I'm just going to run with my team. This should be just... Not even should. This is 100% GG. All right, boys. Back in the win column. Jeez, man. It seems like it was way harder than it needed to be. Fizz mid versus Yoni. We'll take it after action after this. All right, fellas, this is the after action for the game we just played against that Yoni mid. And this game was a little bit of a roller coaster, honestly. I think it was a little bit harder than it needed to be um, on multiple, you know, sides. Like, this, uh, our Trundle, I feel like if he's going to go this build right here, this the hole breaker should be your second item. Like, go, go the Triforce, then rush hole breaker because... With Trundle, you need some type of tankiness to stay in the fight. Because if not, you're just squishy, especially with lethal tempo. Like, you're just going to get murdered. Um, but whatever. This guy was definitely getting under my skin during this game from, like, trying to contest CS versus me and whatever. And just giving this Tom Kench and Graves free gold by getting killed over and over. Um, our jungler did really, really well. I think he was starting to feel the pressure in the back half of the game to make plays. Uh, cause he got caught out a couple times before big objectives, but this guy did really, really well, honestly. So big shout out to our jungler. Um, he helped me out massively in my own lane. And then, yeah, I think we had a very good game for ourselves as well against the Yoni made good roams. Obviously I think, I think we made the game winning play. Um, whenever we caught that Seraphine killed her. And then I guess Graves just wasn't paying attention and he walked right into us. We killed him as well. And then we were able to get the inhibitor after that. And my team was able to take a 4v, uh, 4v3 against the enemy, like the Zara, the Yoni, and uh, the Tom Kinch. So that was really good. And our, our ADC did really, really well this game. 33,000 damage, 14 kills. Hard popped off in her own lane, which kind of allowed us to have a little bit less pressure. But yeah, everyone, everyone on my team, I think, did pretty well. I think this guy could have potentially just like not died as much and mitigated his his uh ability to snowball the enemy team and big shout out to this graves this graves platinum two which means he's probably some kind of smurf but he did really well he got a lot of objectives was making a rounds around the map playing where he needed to be doing what he did but uh i think he just <laughs> think he just got caught slipping on that last play but all right boys yeah so we are at 47 lp kind of sucks um the last game I played right here, this 8 and 10 game, was against the Lissandra. Had we won that, we'd have been one win off a of diamond. So that kind of sucks. Had we won that game, we'd have been set up. So now it, it's so shitty. I'm in my last seven games, or what? No. In my last eight games, I'm seven and one. And somehow I'm getting like very small amounts of LP. So we were at 26 before this game. We got 21 LP from that. 
and so we're at 47. So we are, we'll have to win three games to be able to get Diamond. But I think we could do it. We were just on a six-game win streak. So, uh, yeah, boys, if you enjoyed that video, drop a like. If you're enjoying the content, hit that subscribe button. really does help us to grow the channel, uh, distributes our content out to other people on YouTube. And, yeah, stick around for the next video.